I don't know who's doing this or what's happening, sweetie, but something needs to be done. On Monday, Tracy Myers and her daughter were driving up Blaine Street in Youngstown when they decided to get out and open a black plastic bag on the side of the road. That's when they found a dead dog inside. I don't know, my gut instinct just told me to come. I went and opened it up, ripped it open, and I found that, and it just made me sick. Myers contacted the Humane Agency and Dog Warden on Monday to come pick the dog up. But when they came out Thursday, they found more than they expected. We started looking and we found more bags around where the barricades are right here with more dogs in. So we have a total of three. Nelson said the area is easy to dump in because it's so secluded and there are no homes or businesses on the street. He said they have found dogs dumped there before in the past. In fact, this isn't the first time Myers found a dead dog inside a plastic bag in the same spot. Several months ago, she said she found another one. The first one that I found, it was uh, more so in the summer, and it just like the bag formed the shape of the dog. So when I opened it, it was a black and white pit, and on its head it had a plastic bag, and then the body was wrapped in a blanket and then shoved in the big black plastic bag. There is a sign in the area warning that the road is under surveillance, and anyone who dumps there will be prosecuted. Myers said she doesn't understand why someone would dispose of a dog this way. No dog, whether it's a pet or anything, needs to be disposed like this. This is definitely not to go, the way to go about doing this as far as coming down here and dumping these dogs like this. It's not the way. Nelson said they will be investigating to determine if there was any foul play in the death of the dogs or if they died from natural causes. Reporting for WKBN 27 First News, Jennifer Rodriguez.